I was born and brought up in this area, I was born and brought up on Kerrera. I, I think it's, it's really good that you have a facility like Sam's that are exploring these uh, different ways of uh, uh, making biofuels or making different uh, commercial enterprises. I think that's so important. Yeah, the seaweed we're working with today is uh, Saccharina latissima, which is the sugar kelp. It's very common all around this area and it grows to a very considerable size within a year. There's a couple of other species that we want to look at but for this year we're just focusing on this one species. Uh, my name's uh, Phil Kerrison, I'm a postgraduate researcher at SAMS just up the road from here in Oban. So we're, we're here to harvest the seaweed today. We're taking out these metre substrates that we originally put in in February which we seeded with a seaweed and it's grown over the last four months to quite a considerable size as you can see. There's 11 different materials that we've uh, tested and they've got different uh, surface properties, different chemistries and different physical structures on which for the seaweed to attach so we're trying to work out which ones are the best for their cultivation. Uh, from this we'll be able to work out what materials they will grow to the, the largest size and have the most individual seaweeds on it so we can get the maximum yield for a surface area of uh, sea. So over the next couple of years we're going to be working at larger and larger stale scales with uh, the narrowed down list of properties of the materials and by the end of the project we're planning to work at maybe 50 by 50 metre pieces of material in the water, so horizontally within the water with seaweed growing on it. But in the long term it could be a very large scale business with large areas of the, the sea dedicated to the cultivation of macroalgae. Uh, crops that are grown on land, firstly they can compete with agricultural land for space, they use up fresh water that could be used for other things and they can also uh, push up the price of uh, food crops make it harder for people to afford them. With, the, with seaweed, they've got none of those limitations. I think this area has got a huge potential. And I think, again, SAMS is a, a blazing a trail into the future, which I think is so important. And it's so important to local economy that it's as diverse as possible. And that's the key to success.